Come on, sir. Come here. Here, 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 here. <laughs> Johnson's told me what you intend. As it happens, the man who held me is the same one that you seek. His name is Silas Thatcher. That fancy lad is our slaver. Don't let his velvet tongue deceive you. A crueler and more vicious creature I've never known. What can you tell me of his operation? He hosts at least a hundred men, more than half of whom are redcoats. All this for some slaves? <laughs> Hardly. The man's a commander in the King's troop, in charge of the Southgate Fort. We need to find a way inside. Hmm, let me think on it. In the meantime, I'll attend to our final recruit. John Pitcairn's our man. I'll take you to him. State your business. New recruit. More kindling for the pyre, eh? Well, go on then. How'd you manage that? Did you forget, sir? My commission is with General Braddock. When I'm not attending to you, of course. treacherous. Give me one good reason. I shouldn't kill you right now. Were you planning to announce yourself, or did you hope my men Sir, wouldn't notice your arrival? if you'll allow me to explain. Ho <laughs> ho! By all means. I should like very much to hear this. I have not deserted, sir. I am here under Commander Amherst's orders. Show me a letter bearing his seal, and you might be spared the gallows. I have no such thing. The nature of my work, sir, it's... It's the sort of thing best not put to paper. Hey, them. General Braddock? I suppose I shouldn't be surprised. Wolves often travel in packs. Master Pitcairn won't be here for but a few weeks. I shall return him to his proper post once our work is finished. The devil's work, no doubt. It's bad enough my superiors have insisted. I grant you use of Charles. But they said nothing about this traitor. You'll not have him. Edward, listen to reason. We're done here. See these gentlemen out. Well, that didn't go as I expected. And to think I used to call him brother. What now? Well, they'll chase us off if we try and return. We're done with this camp. As luck would have it, so are they. Come along. What are you planning? To steal Master Pitcairn. What? You'll see. Now, when I give the signal, you're to distract Braddock's patrol and lure them into a dead end. Perhaps down Marlborough. Net one of Lynn or Ship Street. Yes. Much restoration. For the sturdiest and most seamless barrels in America, call upon John Cooper for seven generations. Cooper's the name you can trust. Father Patrick asks all able-bodied men to give an hour of their labor this Saturday as the schoolhouse is in need.
Now! A wider selection of brewery services than any other monster in the city. Oi! You thieves and scoundrels, one and all! Fire on you and your false war! <laughs> After him! <laughs> Unhand him, Edward. You again. Let us go. And John Pitcairn with us. <laughs> I will not have my authority challenged. Nor I. Put them all in chains. again. All debts will be forgotten. You're free now, John. Traitor! Go on, then. Join them on their fool's errand. And when you find yourself lying I assume broken, you've good reason for causing all this madness. What is it you require of me? I'll explain everything on the way. Gentlemen, I believe I found the solution to our problem. Or rather, Odysseus has. How do you? Are you a new guy? The Greek hero, you lobcock. Allow me to explain. We enter Silas' fort under the pretext of kinship. Once inside, we spring our trap, free the captives, and kill the slaver. <laughs> dodgy, dodgy. I like it. Then. Let us begin. First, we need to find ourselves a convoy. should be here soon. We'll attack on my signal. Understood, sir. If we time this right, we can catch them all unawares.
Charles, you and Williams serve as vanguard. Let no man reach us. What about me? You and John will follow from a distance and keep watch over us. I'll signal you when I have need of your services. We're here to help you, along with those held inside Southgate Fort. Free me. Not until we're inside the gate. I can't chance an inspection of the gate going wrong. I'll see you safe. You have my word. Do you know anything of Silas' operation? How many men we might expect? The nature of their defenses? You must be rather important to him if you were given your own escort. Sir, engage them. No. Let Jonathan and Thomas take care of it. As you wish. I wish you'd trust us. Though I suppose it's only natural for you to be wary. So be it. God, man. Come here. I want to take a look. Of course. Only say the word and I'll cut them down. One moment there. Engage the enemy. You. Come on, Who's your officer? Looks like you're to meet the Reaper. All clear. Good evening, gentlemen. State your business. Delivery for Silas. Go on, then. See? I'm freeing you just as I said I would. Now, if you'll allow me to explain... 
Let her go. But she'll give us away. No, she won't. What's the plan? Free the captives and avoid detection. What of Silas? He dies. I know when you're ready to strike. If you don't know, you don't need to. Just do as you've been told and stay out of our way. Of course. from the campaigning back home. Why do you think so many of us volunteer? Good pay, safe work, a chance to own some land. The French would see an end to that. I don't know. It seems to be the Lord. Sometimes I wonder if it's not we who provoke with our sword and our expedition. Ha! That's exactly what they want you to do. Such a shame. The colonies are not gone. Oi, fellas. Apologies for me tardiness, and Cutter had me working late. You know Cutter? <laughs> well, who do you think got me this post? We're like brothers, me and him. Now, what's it Silas want us doing? We're to wrap up the prisoners, relieve them of their finery. Oi, fellas. Apologies for me tardiness, and Cutter had me working late. You know Cutter? <laughs> well, who do you think got me this post? We're like brothers, me and him. Now, 
An hour of quiet was all I asked. Instead, I'm awakened not ten minutes later by this cacophonous madness. I expect an explanation, and it had best be good. How? How did this happen? My precious merchandise set free! It's unacceptable! Rest assured, I'll have the heads of those responsible. But first, first we clean up this mess! Seal the fort, kill any who try to escape. I don't care if they be one of us or one of them. To approach the gate is to be made a corpse. Am I understood? Push them back. Go on. We'll hold back the guard for you. I'll deal with this, sir. For the order. Where is Cutter? He's here! Stop the interloper! He's Benjamin. the one responsible! Glad Kill to have him. you with us. I could use some help. The order stands united. Kill the intruders! All of them! Back, you vile pox! He's the one responsible! Kill him! I'll fillet you like a... Who are you? Name's Haytham Kenway. You don't know me, but I believe the two of you are well acquainted. I made a promise to you, Silas. One I intend to keep. What happens now? We wait. But not for very long, I suspect. It's been several weeks now since we freed the Mohawk prisoners from captivity. I had hoped their leader might make contact, but there's been only silence. My men grow restless. They want to know what comes next, and I do not have an answer. Lee alone remains active, pursuing leads, however slight. He stalks the city streets and scouts the bordering woods, hopeful that he might make contact with one of those we saved. There was a woman there that night. 
It was she who helped the others to safety. If we can find her, I believe I'll have my answers. So, I watch and wait, hopeful that my true mission might finally begin.